Hey guys. Time to play with this chair. And when I say play, I mean play. Because I don't really know what I'm going to do. I know what colors I'm going to use. But I'm not real sure how it's going to turn out. So, I just love that I just got DIY paint on my pants. Fortunately, sorry, my dog is drinking water like right over there. So I think I'm going to start with a coat of Farm Fresh because that's the darkest color that I'm going to use on this chair. And I'm not going to have you watch every bit of my process. I just want to give you little, little window views into what I'm going to do. But yeah, I'm going to start with probably a full um, base coat of the DIY Farm Fresh on this chair. So I'm going to keep going and I'll be back to show you when I get to the next step. I have my first base coat of the Farm Fresh. And now I'm going to take crinoline and I put it on this uh, paper plate because this um, Farm Fresh hasn't totally set up and my idea, not sure how it's going to work out, is I just want to messy paint this. I want it to just look like layers and layers of paint have been put on this chair. So I'm just going to... I don't know what better term to use than messy paint it. I'm gonna go all kinds of different directions with it. And if some of the green gets in the crinoline, I didn't want um, it to contaminate the rest of my paint. So, you know, I think this is gonna be a really cool look for something that's gonna have plants in it. I mean, I don't think I would do a piece of furniture like this, but this was kind of an experiment for me to get to play and have some fun with this free chair and see if I can make it how somebody might want to buy it and put their plants in it. So you kind of get the idea. And when I'm done with this layer, I'll be back. Sometimes I have this really bad habit of I get caught up in the project that I'm doing and I forget I'm supposed to do a video. So what I did was I did my messy paint of crinoline. And then I decided it was a little bit too light. And I went back with a little light layer of apothecary. So you can see underneath the darker is the farm fresh and then we've got the crinoline and then we've got the apothecary and now I just need to let this dry and then I'm going to take it outside and do some sanding to bring that dark through I think this is going to turn out really great can't wait to get the rest of the plant area done for you and I'll be back when we're getting ready to do the sanding. With our handy dandy messy painted chair and the handy dandy sander. The only tool my husband will let me use.
clear waxing this. And then I thought, I have this sweet pick and stock wax, and I would love to try it out. So here we go. It says to paint it on and leave it on um, 15 to 20 minutes and then wipe it off. I actually, I wish it could stay like that. That is some kind of cool looking. The bad thing is this chair is very intricate, so it's going to take me quite a while to get this all painted on here. But I hope you can see how it's looking. I'll be back when I'm all done is all uh, dark oil waxed with the liquid wax. I think it came out awesome. Honey came in here. I was on the phone with my mom and he gave me two thumbs up. So anyway, I guess the final video will be once we get the chicken wire and the potting mesh. So we don't have any chicken wire. Um, so I guess this we'll finish this up when we get that. I'm in love. I really am. I think this is beautiful. This is the final of the chair. <laughs> it's several days later. The oil, the dark oil wax is, is totally dry. And I think this piece came out amazing. I super love it. Honey got the, the chicken wire in there, and then there's our potting mesh. So, I hope you enjoyed the process of this. Not my idea. Um, this was a Waste Not Wednesday at um, Jamie Ray Vintage, and I just happened to have a chair with a round hole in it. So I thought how perfect it would be. So anyway, hope you enjoyed seeing the dogs too. <laughs> Anyway, thanks for watching. Give me a thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button and the bell notification to get notified every time we upload. I've got this project coming up in a video as well. And look what else is coming up. Got that today. So lots going on. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.